Today's Tales sees us playing Battletech once again, and we're playing some more multiplayer against Ornus here. Uh, it was a 20 mil, and I, I haven't really practiced 20 mils yet um, for loadouts, so I kind of, I don't know if my loadout's the greatest, but I've got two Centurions to tank, I've got a Panther for sensor locking, and I've got a Jagamek here. I'm not convinced by the Jagamek, so we'll see how it does. Uh... Uh, I don't know. I haven't even played on the side of this map much. Uh, Alright, so I think what we want to do here is probably take this ridge here. So that we've got a bit of fire acrosswards. Uh, Jagamek can probably stay here. Um, there's not a lot of rock facing to really hide yourself behind. So we might have to... So you know what? We're going to push this way. Um... We'll do our best to push this way. Oh, we're running out of time. I'm running out of time quick. Uh, oh, damn. Okay, we've already got a sensor trace. Um, can we get you over here and you, sir, over here? Woo! Oh, the fast pace. The fast pace. Um, <laughs> damn. All right. So he's got pretty much a similar thing. He's got a light. Um, which is a Commando 2D. I've forgotten what that is. Maybe that's the large laser variant. Uh, he's going to reserve me. Um, that's okay. I wonder if we have... He's behind the hill, I think. We might reserve up. Um, <clears throat> if he reserves again, I'm going to lock that, and I'm going to blast it. Excellent. What can I do for Excellent you? work, my friend. Uh, let's have a look. Actually, can we reserve? Can we lock it? I don't think we can. Um, I've got to be careful because I don't know where all of his mechs are. He has first turn. So I do know that much. Um, could maybe jump across here. Use the forest. And then drop everything on him. Maybe we're just on the edge there, though. Um, so we cannot. Otherwise, there's nothing here. Alright, we're going to reserve. Ah, oh, which is a shame. Um, his turn's first, so... We do have that advantage, at least. Oh, yeah. He's going to reserve all the way. That, that mech is just on the edge. If it was a little bit closer, I'd be able to do this. But I cannot quite. Um... We're just going to play the reserve game for a little. Which is fine. I don't know what he has anyway. All he can see are my two Centurions. So he could lock those up and fire on them. Um, whatever one he locks up though, we can just run it back. Since we know that this is pretty much on the edge of his sensor range, right? Um, which I'm pretty happy for. Alright, so he wants to do that mech. That's cool. Um, so I'm pretty sure if I sprint back here, he should lose vision on me. Mm, seems like a bit of a waste though. Um, bit of a waste. We're going to have to push forward somehow as well. So I know he didn't move, right? Um... Hmm. I hear so he has no... He won't have any vision on this mech here. So I can move him forward now. Um, and sensor lock back, I think. Uh, knowing that he has no real way to get rid of that. Okay, so he has ball working with that. That's okay. Um, can a commando tank a whole lot? We'll soon find out. Uh, what would you have... As the rest of your mechs. Ooh, that feels like a Jager mech. Uh, yeah, so that's a Jager mech with um, LRMs. Alright. That's a bit of armor shredded. You are sitting on a fusion reactor. Alright, so we can fairly much do the same back here. Uh, which is okay. 
We do have to be careful with our positioning of the Jagermech here. Um, because it is pretty much paper thin, right? Uh, those are some pretty good odds to hit. And his commando would not be as tanky as my guy, so even with half hits, we might shred something here. Although we don't do huge amounts of damage, right? But we're definitely going to plow in. And we're going to miss most of what we threw. Alright. Um, maybe I should have... Oh, I've done... This is silly. I should have moved my centurion. Because um, he's going to fire everything into it, pretty much. Pretty much. Damn, that was silly. A uh, hunchback, 4G's, probably a laser. Standing by. Uh, direct line of fire. What do we get? 50 and 65. He can still see us. Mm, pretty happy to just back up. And we will just force him to come across this river. I think that Jagermix in a little bit of a sketchy situation, though. Um, I should have maybe have moved him. That's okay. Uh, same with the Panther. The Panther might be in a bit of a situation as well. Uh, do I want to start shifting things here? What's he got? Another hunchback. So he's going to go for a bit of a punching match here. Something I can do. Uh, is there anywhere I can get vision? Hmm. What do you got? To hit. 45s. Otherwise, I could large laser. 55. Can you not move somewhere a little bit better? Over here. Hmm. All right. I really want a bulwark, but uh, it seems my positioning was not the greatest. This fits actually quite nice. I quite like it. Uh, we'll see if we can't get this poor old uh, commando though out of action. I'd say he's going to put him behind a tree or something. I'd put him behind a rock somewhere. Um, try my best to keep him healthy. See what you want to do with your commando. You gonna reserve? Are you gonna reserve? If you reserves, I'm pretty happy to just plow into this commando. Since I know that uh, everything else has to come up the river towards me. These two mechs have to come towards me, the Jagermech. It's quite nice. I wonder if that's better fit than this. My Jagermech is really weak. Like, I don't want him taking hits here. Alright, so he's sprinting? And is he going to lock my Jagermech? Alright, he's going to lock that. Yeah, alright. Alrighty. What can I do for you? Uh, that's cool, because now we're just going to jump up here. Reface. Get some evasion going. Get some impossible line of sight. Bam. Hello, sir. Hello, sir, indeed. I'm pretty, that should be behind a rock face, right? Oof, did I jump him into vision? Sometimes it's really hard to tell here what is vision and what's not. Uh, so his... Little uh, commando there has no bulwark this time. No entrenched. I keep calling it bulwark. I don't know why. Um, but he is not entrenched this time. So it's going to get a little sticky now. He is coming in with the hunchbacks on multiple sides. Yeah. What can I do you for? Uh, so I've got to be careful of those. He's got no vision this turn round though. So I'm pretty happy to just hammer away at this guy. As much as I can. Because that'll be his vision game gone as well if he loses this. The hunchbacks will do the work though. Um, I'd say the hunchbacks will get in and start doing some serious damage in a sec. 
I'm really concerned about this guy. I have a feeling I stuck him into vision. I should have maybe put him here. The two hunchbacks are coming across the river. I really don't want to fight those hunchbacks in the river. Uh, the reason for that is I do not want them having any advantage on heat. Um, if I can avoid it. What do we get from here? 80. Let's do it. Let's do it. Hopefully we can get our Jagermeck in on this as well. Ooh, come on. We're so close to killing this guy. If I can shift my Jagermeck enough, we can probably kill this thing off. Uh, which means that we then just have to do Hunchbacks. The Hunchbacks, I think... I haven't looked at the stats to know if they've got more armor than Centurions. Uh... I might try, I would like to fight them with this guy having no vision. So if they come around here, I might just rush over here and force him to move at some point. Um, I've got to be real careful they don't get up on top of... Uh, up on top of my own Jagermech here. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to move my Jagermech back this way a little. What does that give us? Pretty good hit chances, right? Uh, the reason I want to keep moving him is I don't trust these guys not to bum rush him. Uh, hopefully, come on, hits. There we go. There we go. No more vision game for him. The hunchbacks will give vision though. I mean, the light, it's only 2 mil, right? I spend a bit more on mine. By about a million more. We're going to reserve up. He's going to push one of these hunchbacks up, I'd say. I probably want to go for his Jagermech. I know it's got weak armor um, on the arms. And if I can get arms off it, I'm in a really good situation there. So if he reserves, I'm just going to plow into that Jagermech, I think. Um, as much as I can. These guys might melt my face if they get up on me. Um... <laughs> Because they are... They are some serious mechs. I would be sprinting them up if I was him. Um, definitely sprint them in. Uh, we're not going to reserve. What we're going to do is we're going to... Oh, we're going to have to jump to get a bit closer here. Over here, we'll jump. We'll get some vision on this guy and we'll start shooting on him as much as possible so he's pretty much weak to us now I'm happy to shoot him I wonder if he's gonna rush straight up this way I'll move my Centurions to cover my Jagermech a bit more unless he pushes that way okay so he's alright so we definitely wanna push Ooh, what's got vision here um mmm mmm yes, mmm mmm uh how far can we run? This is dangerous. I really want to sit tight. I think I can. Hmm. Uh, I think I can rotate this a bit. To be a little bit better than that. Maybe something like this. I think this mech's going to get up on me though. Um, bulwark hopefully will do some work. Uh, I want to shred arms off this thing, though. If I can, we'll start removing any of his evasion as well. Oh, just an arm off this would be so nice. Um, both of my guys are just going to sit here. We'll rotate you as well. And the bulwark... Hopefully, Entrenched will do enough that we survive those hunchbacks on us. I really don't like having... I don't know how I feel about having the Jagermech. I mean, the hunchback, if it gets on top of him, it's going to kill him, right? Alright, what are you going to do? Are you going to plow all your damage into the guy at the front? Is that how you're going to go? I might just move my panther. I might jump my panther towards this thing and freak him out a bit. Unless he wants to go for these. I'd say if I was him, I'd back this up, actually. 
because uh, you've now got vision going on here, right? Mm. Are you sprinting? Okay, he sprinted. Alright, interesting. Now, do I continue to put damage on it or not? Uh, ooh, okay, so we don't have a way to... Oh, we can back up here. It exposes us a bit, though. Um, I'm pretty sure I'm out of vision here, but he's going to move this guy up and get vision anyway. Uh, so let's just back up, I think, and fire. What do we got to hit with this? 55. Alright, let's do it. Copy that, Commander. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to do this quick enough. Fire! Uh, I think I did it wrong. That's okay. Ugh. Not enough time. I should have maybe sprinted this guy out. He's in a really sticky situation. Um. I hear ya. Hmm. I gotta be concerned about this guy right here, though. Really concerned. Can jump this way. Uh, which might force him to come my way. I wonder if he'll come and try and punch me, though. How far can we jump? Alright, not to there. To here, maybe? Oop, oop, there. Uh, so you know what? We might reserve. He might push these guys forward. I might even be able to shoot him in the back. If I can shoot him in the back, I'll be super happy with that, because I know the hunchbacks have pretty weak armor on the back. And if we can get around behind one of these and shoot them... It'll be nice and brutal. Uh, he's going to come in with the hunchbacks. Here we go. He's going to start firing now. Uh, I can't really move my centurions here. Ooh, those AC-20s are going to do a lot of work. A lot of work. Uh, okay, so the 4Gs are the AC-20 ones. They're going to do mass loads of damage here. Mass loads. Uh... Let's keep reserving. We'll just let him do whatever he wants to this one here. Since he's uh, bulwarked. And we'll see if we can't... If he pushes this hunch back up, we might be able to get behind with the panther. Is what I really want. Or I could concentrate on the... I really wish you could click on things to see what they have. Because at the moment, I'd like to know how much armor a hunchback has. I could maybe use the Jagermech on the hunchback if he gives me a side shot, right? If he gives me a side shot, I could probably tear through and get towards that um, that armor on it. Where are you going? Where are you going? You going for my panther? Nope. Ah, oh, there's a P and a G. Okay. So lasers and AC. Okay. Doomed. I wonder if you are doomed. Yes, Commander. We might have to sprint you back here. Uh, although you can't really sprint that far, can you? Hmm. Let's have a look. Uh, how much armor do these things have? A hundred and twenty. All right. Uh, witness. Uh, we'll probably get you to jump this away. And plow a shot into this one, I guess, as you go. Since we already know that we're fighting these guys. Uh, air fire everything. Rock him a little. Rock him, sock him. Uh, if I could get my Jagermech over the top of this hill would be great. Um, we'll see what his Jagermech wants to do. I don't think he's got vision here, right? Uh, he's just going to shoot on probably Buckshot here. Mm, Buckshot might be dead. Might be dead. I'd really like to get a bit more damage into this Hunchback here. don't think it's going to happen, though. 
Maybe I should have just shot at the hunchbacks as they came across. If this Shager mech puts itself out somewhere funny, I'll be happy. Nah. I wonder if he's going to go for it. Yeah, so he's going to just plow... Ooh. Indirect fire, okay. He's just going to plow everything into the one at the front. How's he going for heat? Uh, not so hot. Probably pretty hot, right? Yeah, okay. Waiting for orders. Uh, what has vision? What do we get here? 95s? Hmm. I wonder if he's going to stand and brawl or keep moving. I would move into the Jager mech if I was him. Uh, I really want to shift sideways around this thing, but I doubt I can do that. Could get some crazy high ground shenanigans going on here. Uh, hmm. Alright, let's do that. Get up on this hill. And then maybe we can... I don't think we can move off this hill, though. Uh, just fire everything. Oh, yeah, my centurion's gonna go down before his hunchback, I feel. Definitely feel like it's gonna go down before that. Uh, let's see. So if I sprint you out... How are we doing? Oh, that's such a dodgy sprint. Uh, might just have to have you just stay here. Ah, uh, awkward. Um, I really wish this guy had ACs though. That would be much nicer. Might lose this mech for... Oof, yeah. Hunchbacks are really good on the armor, right? Really good. Um, maybe the bulwark will get us through this. What can I do you for? Ooh, okay, so you don't have vision. I back you up. How are we doing? Hmm. This is a little sketchy because you're going to lose any defense you have, but you're full armor, so we might get you back here. Hopefully, he might try and push forward, I guess. We might be able to knock this guy over. A bit more stability damage he is. Is he on those rocks? Not quite. He's really close to those rocks, though. Just not enough. Hmm. What can I do for you? Could jump. Where can I jump to? Here? Another side shot? I think I'll take that. Uh, Alright, so we've got a bit of dodge. I wonder if he's going to go for my panther. Don't think he will. He might. Uh, we got a little bit of dodge on the panther. Oh, you had to miss with the PPC, didn't you? Alright. So we're into... We're at least into the uh, structure there of this thing. He might freak out and twist it and run towards my panther. Only two evasion. It's a little dodgy. And maybe he should have got closer, but this rock was in the way. I don't think he has vision. Okay, he's going to shift forward. All right, he is coming forward. Um, Is he going to punch me? Ooh. Okay, that's actually kind of better for me, I think. Because now the Jager mech can fire into the side of this thing again. Yes, Commander. Uh, which would be nice. Um, let's have a look. So we can fire everything. I'd really like to hit him. Um, I think Buckshot's just going to stay stable here. If we can get through this, come on, baby. There we go. We're getting some crits on those uh, lasers, at least. So the lasers should be harder to hit with. He's probably going to chew in his AC again. I would have... I wonder if I would have gone for this mech at the back. I don't know. I probably would have gone for that one at the front. It's taken a lot of damage. At least the bulwark's doing the majority of the work here. Uh, the AC-20 is going to do a mass load of damage on this guy, though. Maybe I could have shifted him sideways to save him hitting the chest. I'd say he, he might move over here and shoot him in the side anyway. Um, yeah, there we go. 
He's going to keep that tree cover there. Uh, he's going to chew us up a bit. It might pop something off. Oop, to the leg. There we go. So we lost our arm there. <clears throat> Unfortunate. Indeed. But can we shift enough? We cannot. Hmm. Slightly annoying. Uh, we don't want to give direct fire to that Jagermech, actually. Um, I'm just going to sit tight and shoot again from here. LRM to LRM or not to LRM? I think we're going to LRM. Hopefully we can get rid of this. Come on, what do we got here? 21. A head hit to the pilot too. Hmm. Hopefully, I don't think I can get this Shagamek down here to shoot into the side of this thing though. It is an absolute brawl here. My Panther might be able to get another side shot and rip an arm off. Um, his own Shagamek, although he might get... He might get me down now. He's going to indirect fire with the LRMs. Hmm. I don't know how I feel about that. Uh, we're just going to lose another arm soon. Like Stability-wise, we're okay, though. Uh, is there nowhere we can get down around the side of this thing? There is not. Hmm. What have we got to hit? Pretty good hit chances, right? Really would like to get around on him, but I guess we'll just uh, open up and chew him up again, I guess. Hopefully we can... Come on. Oh, those misses didn't help. Those misses really didn't help. Alright, he's lost his invasion. Uh, not that he had any, I don't think. Panther? I hear ya. Damn, that's a bit awkward, isn't it? Uh, I'll get you back here then. Uh, yeah, let's just walk you back there. And fire, probably the PPC. Uh, hopefully I didn't move you too far. That, yeah, there we go. Um, or do I want to fire everything? Hmm. Could overheat again. Because I really want to kill this guy. Uh, damn. think we might overheat. Really need to do the damage, and we missed. Alright. Alright, a couple more crits though. So, ooh, and he got knocked down. Excellent. So he's going to have a hard time shooting us at least. Ooh, and he goes back in the initiative phase. Yes, that's exactly what we needed. Uh, that heat damage though is pretty unreal. So he's probably, he might kill the Centurion though. I'm a little afraid for the Centurion. A little afraid. If I can, if I don't think I can kill that centri the the uh, hunchback on the ground, I'm probably just going to try and shoot off that laser pack. <clears throat> okay, he's going to come in too. And go for his side shots. Uh, yeah, that's smart, since there's nothing left on that mech on that side. So it's all going to be into the, uh, hot into the leg. Unlucky. Ooh. Okay, so we've got a bit of... Bit of damage there. Alright, so let's have a look at what we've got. What have we got left? We've got medium lasers. Um, what I'd really like to do is probably just mm, reposition a bit better here. Uh, we might do this, and we might take the shots to the side here. He might even go for the rear armor, I think. Uh, yeah, let's... We're going to reposition ourselves so that he goes for the rear of this mech. Uh, we got enough to kind of get us there. We're definitely going to go on... I think we're going to go on what's left of this. We're just going to fire everything in. Drop them all in. Hopefully we can pop off that laser. Really, you managed to miss with most of that. Buddy. Buddy, buddy, buddy. We're definitely going to move in with this. Um, reposition like this. Come on, we need to pop off that. At least pop off that laser pack so he's not doing that to us. Although we could... Uh, what do we got? 25? 
Let's just go for the chest. We might be able to kill this guy. Come on, buddy. Come on, there we go. That's what we're talking about. So now he might go for the back of this thing. If we're... Okay. Um, I really want to get the panther onto this thing and annoy it. If I can. And then wildfire will probably just... We'll just keep playing into this guy, I think. We've lost all of our bulwark here, though. Um, so that's a little dangerous. Yep, down for that. Excellent. Whoa, so much damage. That mech is all sorts of hammered. Um, but I'm down for that. He shot into the side of it that's got all of its armor left. Yes, Commander. Uh, I'm pretty happy for that. Can we get somewhere... What can we fire from here? I really want to get in and fire most of my weapons. If I can. Do I want to go for the Hunchback? I really would like to go for that Jagamek. Um, but maybe we can just gang up on the Hunchback here. And do some solid damage on him. Shame I don't have focus yet. I really would like focus. He's going to get this Hunchback in pretty close next round though, I'd say. Um, we get some nice solid hits on that. A miss and a miss. Wow, those lasers were useless. At least with all the ACs hit. Um, so Witness here is probably going to jump. Where can we jump and fire? Here? Really? Uh, let's do it. Or do we just want to keep jumping around? We might just want to keep jumping around, right? Hmm. You know what? Let's reserve witness. By. If he moves this mech and he gets any sprint, we might just jump witness far enough to be able to sensor lock and remove that. If we're lucky. Uh, I'd say I'm going to lose the Centurion, which means we're going to have to battle it out with this one. Uh, I might... I could maybe back down this hill. I'd... The smart play here would be actually to shoot my... I think to shoot my Jager mech if he's got vision of it. Because uh, you could rip off arms and it would do a lot of a lot of damage to the arms. He's thinking about it. Focused. Uh, what's he going to do? I'd go for... Would I go for the Jager mech? You might be able to rip off an arm. AC. Oh, I'd say this guy's gone. There we go. Down he goes. It was only a matter of time, right? Um... A Centurion here might just sit tight, though, and fight. Um, did he get invasion? No, he did not. So we're going to... We're going to jump. To... Where can we jump and fire? Uh, nowhere. Alright, we'll just jump. Jump and bulwark. And we will cool ourselves down over here. And we do not gain much of our heat back, do we? Um... Whew. Maybe I should have just sprinted. Here, <clears throat> Maybe I should have just sprinted. Sumo. You, sir, I think are just going to have to sit and fight with this guy. If you can. Uh, wow, you are overheating a lot too, buddy. Um, Alright, we're going to have to... We'll work this up. Hopefully get some heat back from that. Unfortunately, we're firing to the wrong side. There's not a lot on that side. The AC-20 is over here. Um, this guy is probably going to maul us a fair bit as well. Hmm. I really want to get this in. I might just have to sprint. That was maybe a bit silly to use the jump jet when I'm so hot already. What is he going to do? I'd move here. Let's have a look. Can't move here. I'd move maybe. <clears throat> All right, he is gonna. He's gonna send in the uh, the AC. Yeah, it's a bit of damage. Bit of damage. We're we're rocking a little. I'm here. Uh, what can we do? I really want to make sure that I'm not in a position to get shot at. Um, if I move here, we still have 85s. Uh, if I move here, 85s, and then I think if I get in danger, I can shift back a bit. Mm, or we can move in for the laser fire. 
from here we get to fire lasers. Mm, maybe we'll sit tight. What do we got for armor? We've got 21 seconds. Uh, probably got enough armor, right? To sustain a hit from this thing. He has used his focus, so we've got that going for us. Actually, let's just fire. Fire away, buddy. Fire away. Ooh, damn, that leg is close. Alright, heat sink destroyed. That's nice, because he is actually overheating. Um, like my own mechs are all pretty hot and cooking. Witness. Whoa, 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 you're not sprinting this time. Uh, you're not right, um... You're not jumping, that's for sure. Alright, we're gonna sprint over here. Damn, you can barely sprint, can't you? Uh, let's sprint here. I don't mind that I'm on these rocks. We're gonna freak this guy out as much as we can. Hopefully he'll maybe run away. I don't know what he's gonna do. I'd push... Is he gonna push him with this? Get some vision over here, shoot my Jagamek. I need to back that Jagamek up actually. Um, and probably relax on firing the medium lasers just to keep some heat. Um, if he pushes up onto this, he would do alright because um, this thing has minimum fire range. Instead it's just uh, beating him down here. Beating him down. If I get some lucky RNG, if I get some lucky RNG it could go either way still. Because his Jagamek can do... A fair chunk of damage. But I'm pretty happy with what's going on here. The temptation to run is pretty high, but um, just keeping this bulwark up reduces a lot of incoming damage. Is he letting it tick down? Or is it broken? Uh, please don't break. Alright. He's letting it tick down. Uh, in that case... Oh, he's got bulwark. Okay. Um, could maybe... I might focus with the... I'll use my focus on the... Um, on wildfire here. Uh, so let's have a look. Uh, that sucks. Alright, we're overheating there, but, uh, apparently he did do a command, but, um, it didn't happen, which kind of sucks for him, since, uh, he would have been better off actually attacking. Uh, yeah, I mean, he's got Bork, he would probably do fine. He's trying to keep his Jagermech here out of trouble, but hopefully we can get up on it in a sec. We're tanking a bit. I'm pretty happy with the Centurion to tank through most of this. The focus, when we focus, we'll remove this guard here. So we should be able to get through that pretty easily. Um, so we're going to go... And we're going to... Get out of my way. We're going to... Can you fire from here? Uh, you can. Alright, so we're going to focus up here. And we're going to blast this guy for everything we've got. Uh, and we're gonna overheat. That's cool. That's an arm gone at least, so that's one medium laser down. Uh, I think he lost the heat sink as well. I think we're winning this though. I mean, I'm pretty happy with what's going on. Um, we're gonna keep sprinting around. I think if we sprint to... Oh, yes. Would you freak out about a mech that close? Uh, he might punch me though, which I really don't want. I'd rather just have vision coming in. So let's sprint around here. We'll get most of our heat back. He might turn and fire on my panther here, which should probably be the smart. But it will save my centurion. Another turn of taking damage. I'm happy for my panther to get mauled. Or he could run his hunchback back. Oh, this... Jagamek is actually really hot. Um, so he might not be able to fire for a full effect this turn. Interesting. I definitely don't want to move any of my mechs. The problem here is uh, any movement right will take out the entrenched. So the panther's the only one that really has to do work here. 
and if the panther can get up and just just hassle this thing like all i want to do is hassle it so if i jump behind it shoot it in the back you know he's got to turn he's got to think about what's going on he's going in for the punch he is Ooh, would i punch there hmm. i don't think so not if he has not if he has bulwark on this. Does he have bulwark? I don't think he does actually. I think because he skipped the turn, he lost all of his um, stuff there. We could. If we shoot, what are we. How hot are we getting? We're getting pretty hot. Um, punch for 70, or I could hit for 50, 90, 110. But I'll take some internal damage here. We could lose an arm. What's on this arm? Medium and a large. Uh, let's do it anyway. Pretty happy to fire into this. Uh, can we get... Oof. Is the leg gone? Alright. Um, this mech's probably too hot to fire onto that though. I could go for that other leg. Um, with that other leg gone, ooh, we're cooking in there. Um, so with that other leg gone, he will lose this mech, which will just leave his Jager mech here. Um, which is pretty good. Not too shabby at all. Okay, he's backing that one up. Is he going to fire on the panther? What would I do? Hmm. Fire on the panther, maybe? Snow... I mean, you might be able to kill it. But... Oh, well. That's unfortunate. All of that missed. Uh, we'll go for the punch next time with Sumo. Uh, wildfire. Uh, we're just going to fire from here. Chew off this leg. Um, we'll shut down with that, so we won't be doing that. Can we just overheat? We can uh overheat warning what do we got 53 i think we'll fire everything in um just to make sure if there's any misses then uh we're pretty much covered at least and now it's just the jagamek so we'll probably start running the centurion ford to start doing some uh some melee damage here uh meanwhile witness is actually going to Probably jump behind this guy. Um, if we can. Can we death from above? Hmm. I don't really want to death from above. Uh, we might just jump. I'd really like to just jump into the trees here. But uh, can we just move into the trees? We can. Uh, we got some really poor shots with the PPC though. 75 from here, but we get nothing. So we'll probably just jump here and fire with everything. And maybe hope to rip off some arms here. I doubt it. Oof, that, that cooks us so much though. Cooks us a lot. Uh, yep, there's the cooking. There's the cooking. It's not looking good. Uh, so he's got no vision on the mechs back here. So I could probably just, uh, hmm, I really would like to move and probably just fire one weapon. I don't have enough real heat here. Oh my. Uh, there we go. <laughs> I was like, I don't have enough to really fire anything, but I do just. So we're shooting to the other side. I really want to rip off some of these arms, get rid of some of these ACs. Um, and see how we go. It's unfortunate that he lost his light mech at the start. If he hadn't lost that mech, he would have probably been in a better position to maybe range me out a bit. Uh, I'd say he's uh, contemplating quitting here. Since it's a foregone conclusion. We'll see. We'll see. He hasn't said anything. 
has not said anything. Come on, buddy. Let me finish it. I haven't finished a game in a while. Most people quit. Most people quit. And they see it get to this point. Nothing? Something? Anything? Nope. Alright. Guess we're just guarding and entrenching. Yes, Commander. Uh, so we're going to move to the flank. Um, shoot him in the side. And see if we can't rip an arm off. How hot are we? We're pretty hot. Um, let's just ease off with some of these ACs. Uh, Keep an eye on my heat commander. Hmm. Uh, he's having problems. Real problems. Uh, let's have a look. So we probably just want to... Should we just run in and punch? Let's just run in and punch it. Run in and punch it. Save some heat. Oh. We were close to ripping in the arm off. He's... I mean, he could just shoot the panther, right? Um, if he really wanted to, we could just sprint in. You know what? Let's just move and fire. He's got no... Uh, he's got vision there. Where has he not got vision? Back here. Okay. Um, you know what? Let's just sprint in. Get our centurion on top of him. Get some sprint going. We've got no evasion on these guys, so it's not really going to matter. Um, and what is he going to do? What is he going to do? Really? Uh, my turn? Surely not. There we go. Is he going to punch my panther? He's going to shoot my panther in the back. Oh. Nope. He's just going to turn. And run. <laughs> I think he's had enough. Oh, sensor lock? Oh, okay. Interesting. Uh, I'm not sure if that's the mech I would take sensor lock on. Order acknowledged. Uh, let's fire everything in. up just a little here to fire all of this stuff uh, yeah sure let's just back up and fire oh, bam hopefully we can uh, oh my god the poor aim on this uh, on this mech so he's letting us just finish it off so I mean I liked his I liked his build I thought if he had managed to push across that river a bit more intact it would have been uh, a little bit better for him, but uh, unfortunately for him, it was a hard road getting across there. Come on. Come on, baby. God. <laughs> My mechs are missing. All over. Yeah? All over. All right. Should be able to just run forward here and plow into this. I think we'll just fire everything. Hopefully, whatever hits should end it. <laughs> and, uh... Alright, we'll overheat. Doesn't matter. Come on. Blow them apart. Oh my god. There we go. We've won. Luckily, thanks, Ornus, if you're watching this, for uh, sticking around. Um, most people would just quit by then, but all good. Let's have a look at how we did. Um, that poor old... Okay, so he came in slightly higher than me. Um, yeah, this commando had a really bad time. I wouldn't have moved it the way he did, because it let me, it let me continue to sensor lock it, and he didn't have any ball work, and he had a lack of evasion on it. I might have considered <clears throat> pulling it back um, and rethinking about how I was going to get across that river because 
he couldn't really afford to lose it. He did have the hunchbacks to push, but the push was already... I mean, what he wanted to do, right? I know what he wanted to do. He wanted to push with the hunchbacks, and he wanted to sense a lock with the commando and keep firing with the Jagermech, right? As you push. That's the idea. But the commando was too far forward and had no cover. It was a really bad situation for it. I'm actually really liking having a panther for um, for a sensor locking mech, just because it provides a lot more armor. I mean, you can see 40 on the core there, 30 on the arm, 30 on the arm, versus 70, 50, 50. I mean, you're paying a lot more for it, but I feel like it's a, it's a better choice. And the Centurions are really good workhorses. I like the SC ones, but these LRM-10 ones are not so bad. The large laser it does okay. I mean, and they don't heat up all that much. Shagamek, it was interesting. I I don't know how I still feel about the Shagamek. Um, I I would prefer. I guess if I was gonna get one of these, I don't know what I would replace this with. I'd have to have a think about that. But um, good game to my uh, opponent there. And uh, with that, we'll take a break. Tune in next time for Adventures of BattleTech. Hey guys, thanks again for watching. If you like what you've seen, hit that subscribe button or leave me a comment on anything you want to see in the future.